Cassie's been a bit sick lately. She's come down with the flu and she's been pretty much bedridden for the last three days. And I swear, anytime that I get the flu and I'm in bed for three days, she calls it the man flu. Three days in bed means you've been diagnosed with the man flu. And she knows best, so I'm gonna use her diagnosis. She's been in bed for three days, so she's got the man flu. So I thought to complete the man flu package, I might as well turn her into a man. Got some henna ink here, and I'm gonna give her some nice fresh facial hair for her to enjoy. And I know what you're thinking, surely you're not gonna prank your wife while she's in bed sick. Well, yes, yes I am, but my justification behind that is maybe she just needs cheering up. A bit of humor in her life, and that'll make her feel better. It's probably a low chance of that being the cure, but uh, hey, if there's anything I can try and do to help, I'm gonna try and give it a go. Let's go see if she's asleep. Oh my gosh, my back is killing me from leaning over the bed just then. But the job is done. Now we just wait for her to wake up and see how she takes it. Uh, morning, brother. How are you feeling? What have you done? <laughs> no, this is not on. I'm sick. What have you done? <laughs> I'm, trying, I'm trying to help. Freaking hell. <laughs> Let's go for a look. Gosh, Josh, what have you done? <laughs> no, I'm sick. We don't yep. do this when we're sick. I oh, don't. No, let me explain. So you've been in bed for three days now, right? Anytime I'm in bed sick for three days, you say I've got the man flu. You've been in bed for three days, so you've got the man flu. So I thought I'd better turn you into a man. <laughs> Seriously, Josh, and not while I'm sick. Wait, 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 I can justify it. How? Because you're sick and I thought, hey, maybe if I can try cheer you up a little bit and get a smile. I got a little smile before. I got a smirk. Are you feeling better? Is it? <laughs> Now I have to deal with this. Okay, well, that brings us to justification number two then. Justification number two. Justification number two. I've thought this through. Technically, this is the best time I can possibly do this to you. Why do you say that? Because you don't have to go anywhere. You're in bed anyway. You can just have a few dots on your face and no one will ever know about it. What about our daughter? What is she going to think? She's going to be like, mommy's got the man flu. <laughs> there we go. No. See, you're feeling better. You're feeling better. Put no. it there, bruv. No. Put it there, brother. No. Wait, wait. Put that thing away. By the way, can I please just like get some sort of gratitude for... Look at this. I, I shaved this out for you this morning. Give me some sort of recognition. Oh, no, I get it. What? Yeah, okay. Now I got the same facial hair as you. I get it now. You just got that? Yes. You It, it took... You, you didn't know that was supposed to be facial hair? Josh, and I just woke up. I'm okay. drugged up to my eyeballs. I've got a beard on my face. Well, I want whatever you're on. 